It has been a while since my last video. I was occupied with university, that is why I couldn't upload. I want to speak with you guys about one thing. Wait a second. About one thing, and that is the continuation of gym douchebags. In the last part, I've spoken about the gym douchebag Mona. The type, that is the Mona. Thinking about it, is the Mona really a douchebag? Because what if they do it unintentionally? Are they then really a gym douchebag? That is an irrelevant discussion that probably will never take part in the world anyway besides this video. Gym douchebags too. I was thinking about it. They are definitely doing it intentionally. There is, there is no excuse for this behavior. I have seen that before with my own eyes, otherwise I wouldn't even be reporting on this. Gym douchebags 2. Who are the gym douchebags 2? Type 2. Type 2 is the aggressive type. The aggressive... The right... Wait. Excuse me for the little interruption. Type 2. The aggressive type. They do it intentionally, as I said and mentioned. And that is the thing. The aggressive type, they need to prove themselves. What do I mean with that? There's this innate thinking of manliness that if I'm being hyper aggressive, you don't have to be super kind to everybody. Okay, nobody is. I don't. But if you're hyper aggressive for every, every little thing, as if you're having right rage, then that is a problem. And also, what I mean is, you don't have to abuse steroids. In order for you to be this type, the second type, the aggressive type, you can not take steroids and be that, or you can take steroids and be that as well. I was 16 years old, I was training. To the right of me, there was this person, he was also training. And whilst he was training, he was interrupted, but for a little thing. It was nothing major. Short interruption, and what he did was he lashed out on that person who interrupted him. And everybody just looked at him, and that is a red flag because that person whom he lashed out on was maybe a beginner, maybe new. Nobody, I mean, why would you lash out on somebody who didn't even? What is there is no justification on lashing out on anybody in the gym to be honest. I don't even know how to justify this. I'm trying but I can't. So the aggressive type. They have to prove themselves. They're annoying. My recommendation on how to deal with them is if they walk path A, just walk path C, okay? Walk away. Don't have nothing to do with it. Because most people don't anyway. And it is important to know that not everybody, I mean, what is the percentage of people like that in the gym? It is almost close to zero. So it is even a stereotype. And this stereotype is not really alive. I mean, it is alive because there are some people, but it is not really, no gym ever tolerates that. No, the community never tolerates that. Nobody does. And it's a good thing to not tolerate it. But that's that. Just having to prove yourself being hyper aggressive. Not my way, not my wave, probably not yours as well. I just wanted to mention that because it has been floating in my head lately. And also, that's that. I am active on Twitch and I'm planning to be more active on Twitch. I have been active before, deleted my account, I have a new account now. And I'm going to be active again. So I would appreciate it if you follow me on Twitch. You don't have to don't do the subscribe with the money, just f the follow. That would mean a lot of that would mean a lot to me. Also, that's that. I just needed to share that with you guys. I have been active before on Twitch. I will be active again on Twitch. So I would love it. I would love it if you guys follow me on Twitch. Don't pay me anything. Don't do this subscription where you have to pay none of that. Just the follow button. That's it. I don't deserve any of that. Just follow if you wish. Yeah, what is the future trajectory of my channel? I think that's that with gym douchebags. My 
my experience in the gym is overall positive. I love the benefits you gain from the gym. It is not only that you gain some muscle, and I mean muscles are muscles great. I love it. If if only for the aesthetics, I don't know if I would pursue it that much, but the byproduct of going to the gym of working out of taking care of yourself is far greater than any medication that you can ever get from any doctor or anything like that so that's that thank you guys i have nothing else to say yeah peace